Welcome to the Hyperspace Vault, uh, Star Wars collectors and fans. Uh, Dave and Alex here. Today we're doing a uh, Black Series Wave 21 preview and Star Wars Celebration recap, which wrapped up uh, on Monday. Monday, and it lasted all last weekend. A lot of cool stuff was announced, and a lot of the teaser trailer to Rise of Skywalker. Uh, a lot of cool stuff at uh, Celebration Chicago this year. So uh, we're going to be taking a look first up at Black Series Wave 21. I can't wait for this wave, by the way. Yeah, this wave is coming out this summer and includes Dr. Alfra. Yeah, this looks really cool. It has kind of like the Han Solo style pants. Yeah, nice looking figure. Um, this is a figure or a character from the comic book series. And um, this wave uh, features um, uh, this figure and the two droids. So pretty cool uh, for the fans of that um, comic book series. She comes with a hat that's removable and a blaster. Next up we have the uh, protocol droid Triple Zero. I believe that's what you call him. He's like an assassin droid, I guess. He has all these knives and stuff on his, for fingers instead of actual fingers. So that's kind of interesting. He has also interchangeable hands and the movable elbow joints that um, Forlom, that was featured on Forlom. Yeah. Uh, next up we have uh, the, the astromech droid BT, which is, I guess, another assassin droid that she uses. I don't, we don't know much about the storyline of that or exactly what these figures are for, but um, pretty, kind of interesting with all these different attachments on the droid and he looks his head looks really cool because he has like a bunch of guns and stuff imagine if he saw that coming towards you what would you do next up we have ezra bridger now this is this one that we're really looking forward to um ezra looks phenomenal here uh the face sculpt the head sculpt looks great he comes with his lightsaber blaster and helmet Alex, I know you're really looking forward to Ezra. Yeah, he's my favorite character from Star Wars Rebels, and I really can't wait until this figure. Yeah, the green gloves are kind of interesting. I've never really noticed that before, that he had green gloves. Uh, the, f the face on the artwork there looks weird looking on the box. Yeah, I know they're going for realistic look, but no. Okay, next up we have Chopper, and this is another phenomenal looking Black Series figure from the pictures. Uh, can't wait to see Chopper. He comes with the blast effect uh, rocket thing that comes out the bottom there, and uh, a, a blast effect stand, which is really cool. And in the box, he has his third leg, with that center wheel, and an additional leg off to the side there. Yeah, we also can't wait for Zeb. He has not been announced yet, but people are saying that he's going to be out in a deluxe packaging. Next up, we have Obi-Wan from Episode 1. This looks like a great figure. Um, comes with a lightsaber. No uh, Jedi cloak, though, which is kind of surprising. Yeah, um, but there was a special edition version of this figure that came in the... Um, 20th anniversary of Phantom Menace pack and it was really cool but only the sadly only the people at Star Wars Celebration got it and we didn't go there. Yeah. Next up we have the Black Series Luke Skywalker X-Wing helmet. Now this looks really cool. This was uh, unveiled at um, Celebration and the images that they showed of this I was just blown away by the details and the look of this. Looks really great. Um, it comes with a surround sound system inside the helmet with three speakers and it plays uh, battle sounds and I think dialogue from the movie maybe but look inside that helmet it's like fully stitched with padding I mean that looks great mm -hmm. it has a mic boom there and the visor has LED lights that flash that simulate like the battle of either uh, the Death Star battle you have or Hoth the hot battle on Hoth yeah, and I can't wait for this since Luke is my favorite Star Wars character, too. Yeah, that looks really cool. I can't wait to see it. Okay, next up we have the exclusives, Black Series exclusives that were announced uh, during Celebration. And first up is Emperor Palpatine with his throne. Now, this looks absolutely amazing. He comes with three head sculpts, uh, Force Lightning, Kane, and the throne that he sits in. Yeah, and I think it's really cool because um, they are... They announced it just in time for people, for fans to know about um, Ian McDermott returning to play as his role as uh, the Emperor in Episode 9. 
yeah, that's going to be interesting to see how that plays out. Now, that, look, here's some additional photos of that, and there's the force lightning. I don't know if the force lightning just attaches to his hands, or if the I think force there's... lightning is made onto the hands, like an additional hand set. I think there is additional hands. And that figure is uh, Amazon exclusive and is available for pre-order now. Next up, we have Galaxy's Edge, uh, some sets from Galaxy's Edge that are exclusive. This, this... is a four-pack because it comes with that droid, yeah. but um, I like the Golden Trooper from Resistance. And then there's a droid pack uh, that includes Rex, the, the former droid that used to take the Star Tours, and uh, the first C-3PO with working elbow joints, but still, he's just gold dull paint. We need a vacuum-formed or vacuum plated C3PO in the Black Series yeah, line with the really I, shiny finish. Yeah, I can't wait until they release mm. one like that. If and they the third do. pack, um, we're kind of this was the one we'd be kind of interested in. Is it comes with Hondo? It comes with another Ray, another Chewy, but uh, this is the first Black Series figure of Hondo, so that's really cool. But yeah, unfortunately, and... these are park Disney Park exclusives. That's the only place you can find yeah, them. Yeah, Galaxy's Edge. But yeah. um, I can't wait for Hondo. He's one of my favorite characters from Rebels and Clone Wars because he's so funny. Okay, that wraps up this video. Uh, thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe, like, and may the Force be with you.